Gunter Steiner disagrees with Christian Horner over F1's new budget cap changes. Gunter Steiner continues to disagree with Christian Horner over F1's budget cap rules after new agreements were put into place. Horner has claimed F1's 3% budget cap increase to £115 million, £140 million, is still, not enough, for teams to manage with the rising inflation levels. Meanwhile, Steiner says concessions were made due to rising costs but stressed it is vital figures don't go out of hand, which would favor the big teams. Steiner has defended F1's budget cap and think it has successfully made F1 more competitive. Speaking to Express Sport, he said, in principle, I think the budget cap made Formula One what it is right now, very competitive. It has a lot to do with the technical regulations but the budget cap really brought the teams closer together. I know the big teams are still a little bit in front, but they are a little bit in front and not massively out there anymore and I think that's thanks to the budget cap. That was always the plan for the budget cap. All 10 teams scored points in the first six races this year, that's down to the budget cap because we are closer together. We should focus to keep a budget cap in place so the sport gets more and more interesting. The longer we go, mid to long term, some of the midfield teams it should be possible to go on the podium and even win races. We don't want the budget cap going up, we agreed to make some increases, because inflation is different to what it was predicted. It is very high, nobody in the world is happy about it, but it happened, so we made some concessions and made the budget cap higher a little bit. Some of F1's larger teams had called for more assistance to ensure they could pay staff and fly equipment to the 22 races. Horner even claimed seven teams may be forced to miss the final four races as budgets were stretched. But, Steiner fears some teams could still pocket the money for development reasons which would have an impact on the competitiveness of the sport. Steiner told Express Sport, but going forwards we should be careful not that it goes out of hand again and the big teams run away with money and just with developments they can do more. The small teams cannot follow with these amounts of money. He added, can you imagine if one of the midfield teams in two or three years starts to win races? That is what people want to see, they want to see change. It doesn't need artificial change with the balance of performance, we can do it competitively with a budget cap. It is achievable.